What's going on guys? Matt Stafford here. Uh, welcome to Scenarios. This is where we look at things in the NFL that are never going to happen, but we're just kind of wondering what if. Well, unfortunately though, this one is going to happen. We're losing my boy. My wide receiver, guys. We're losing Megatron. <laughs> and I just had to make this video. Because I'm at Stafford, and I don't know what I'm going to do without him. I don't know what I'm going to do without him. And, and guys, be sure to like this video because next scenario, we are actually going to look at what would happen if uh, Cam Newton and Peyton Manning switched teams. What would happen if both of these Super Bowl quarterbacks were on the op opposite team and how would uh, those teams do You know, with those guys leading their squads. Uh, but man, we, we got we got some troubles, guys, because, you know, I'm looking at my depth chart right here. You know, I got to be throwing to these guys next season. I got to be throwing that football, my little sidearm right there, man. And uh, I'm not going to win a Super Bowl with damn, with damn Megatron. Who am I going to throw to now? Let's see. Who am I going to throw to now? I got Golden Tate. I got... God. How am I going to go from Megatron to Jimmy Ross? Oh God, Corey Fuller. Corey Fuller! Why am I going to do this? Ryan Bro or Ryan Bros. Boy never even plays. Lance Moore. Yeah, sure. I understand that uh, we probably are going to get a different wide receiver. But we ain't going to get no Megatron. That's my boy, man. That's, that's the guy that I could double coverage. I would just whoop right to him every time. Setting records. Setting records. You know, I mean... So we going up here, guys, against the uh, Chicago Bears. We're going to simulate this game here, see how our team does, see who I can throw it to, because I don't know. I don't damn know. There ain't no there ain't no coaching game plan that's going to help me. There ain't, no go, there ain't no coaching game plan that's going to help me. I just hope that, I don't know, I hope that our new, new GM or somebody can get us somebody, maybe convince Kelvin to come back for one more season. I'm going to miss this guy. I'm going to miss this guy with all my, my, with all my Matt Stafford heart. Um, so let's go ahead and simulate. See how we do against the Chicago Bears. Very good team in our division. They always they always seem to beat me. They always seem to. Everybody seems to. I know that's why Kevin Johnson don't want to stay. How are we gonna have the like the best running back all time and Barry Sanders and one of the best wide receivers all time and Kevin Johnson had nothing to show for it? How how do I only have what one, two playoff appearances and no playoff wins? I don't know. This is just a depressing video. Just a very depressing video, guys. Okay, end of game. Please. Please, show me, show, show me the love. Show me that I have some way to pass to out here. Oh my gosh, the first quarter, we down 10-0. We down 10-0. We scored. Oh God, I see a lot of incompletes by myself out here, but by Matt Stafford. Oh God, we actually, we actually kind of, kind of got a close game going on here. Please, please, victory. Oh. Come on, come on, show a miracle, show us a miracle. We got a miracle going. Oh, oh, we won, we won by one point. Oh my life. Who did I? I gotta check these stats out. We did without Megatron. There we go. Get, get going. Get geek, Caldwell. That's my coach. That's my coach. He said we don't need no Megatron. Look at that old man run. We don't need you. There's me. <laughs> Matt Stafford right there. That's me, guys. Four touchdowns, two interceptions. Who says I don't need Kelvin Johnson? I believe I did. But I was just joking the whole entire time. I love you, Megatron. But I'm Mega Arm. Okay, I got the Mega Arm going right here. I'm going to zoom in them passes. Please believe, Bears. Please believe, man. Anything can happen. Anything can happen. Check out these passing stats, man. Well, we have 243 passing yards. Not a single one to my boy Megatron because he don't play no more. But it don't matter. Somebody pick up the slack. I threw four touchdown passes. Let's go ahead and check out these stats here real quick. Check out these stats. Ooh, Jay Cutler. I see you, uh... Oh, two touchdown passes. Good job. But I threw four of them. Two interceptions. So did you, though. So did you though. All right, let's check out these. Uh, let's check out my wide receiver game right here. How do we do? How do we do? Who do I pass it to? Receiving. Who did good? Who did good? My boy Corey Fuller, man. I made fun of you at the beginning of this episode, but you caught two touchdown passes. Jeremy Ross, I made fun of you too. Go and take. I was all right with you. And who else? Oh my god, Brandon Pettigrew, man. You actually caught a ball, you didn't drop it. This is a miracle, guys. Man, maybe the future is a little bit bright. You know, maybe I'm just being pessimistic because I've been throwing the ball to this guy in double coverage. He's been catching it for the past 10 years now. Uh, maybe I'm, I don't know, maybe I'm just a pessimistic out here, guys. But I'm going to lead this Detroit Lions team. We're going to make the playoffs. And we're going to win a Super Bowl for you, Calvin. For you, Calvin. I promise. Thank you all so much for watching. Peace out, my friends.